Japan, Britain and Italy, are merging their next-generation jet fighter projects in a groundbreaking partnership spanning Europe and Asia, that is Japan's first major industrial defense collaboration beyond the United States since World War II. The BAE Systems Tempest is a proposed sixth-generation jet fighter aircraft that is under development in the United Kingdom for the Royal Air Force. The aircraft is intended to enter service from 2035, gradually replacing the Eurofighter Typhoon. It is being developed as part of the Future Combat Air System program by a consortium known as Team Tempest, which includes the Ministry of Defence, BAE Systems, Rolls-Royce, Leonardo, and MBDA UK. £2 billion is planned to be spent by the British government on the initial phase of the project up to 2025. Both Italy and Sweden signed a Memorandum of Understanding in 2020, committing to explore collaboration on the programme. The UK and Japan have announced they are working together on the joint development of engine and radar demonstrators. Furthermore, talks are ongoing to combine efforts with Japan's own Mitsubishi FX fighter project as a means to cut development costs for both countries. Tempest will be modular, both to be easily role adapted to fit the particular mission, as well as have easily upgradable components during its lifetime. It has delta wings, and a pair of outwards pointing vertical stabilizers. It will incorporate stealth technology, be able to fly unmanned, and use swarming technology to control drones. It will incorporate artificial intelligence, deep learning, and carry directed energy weapons. The aircraft will have a cooperative engagement capability, which is the ability to share data and messages with other aircraft and coordinate actions. Tempest will feature virtual cockpit shown on a pilot's helmet-mounted display using a Striker 2 unit and an adaptive cycle engine that utilizes composite materials and improved manufacturing process to be lightweight and have better thermal management while still keeping costs low. Leonardo has proposed a radar warning receiver that is four times as accurate at one-tenth of the size of current units. The aircraft has a slightly raised rear fuselage section to accommodate S-shaped ducting behind its twin-engine inlets to reduce its frontal radar cross-section. Its two engines are placed deep inside the fuselage to minimize radar and infrared signatures. The aircraft's two generators are able to provide ten times more electrical power than the Typhoon's. One of the generators serves as an electrical starter, eliminating the need of a mechanical or compressed air starting system for the engine. The pilot's helmet will monitor brain signals and other medical data, amassing a unique biometric and psychometric information database for each pilot, that will grow the more the pilot flies. The aircraft's AI will work in conjunction with the database to assist the pilot, for example taking over flight controls if the pilot blacks out due to g-force, or increasing its own workload when the pilot is overwhelmed or under increased stress, for example taking over terminal guidance after weapon deployment if the pilot's attention is focused on a more imminent threat to the aircraft. The AI is also intended to act as a gatekeeper, that will pass the overwhelming quantity of sensor and intelligence data collected by the aircraft to identify key threats, while throttling, the rate processed data is provided to the pilot to prevent the pilot being overloaded. Other countries could join the project, Britain said, adding that the fighter, which will replace its Typhoon fighters and complement its F-35 Lightning fleet, will be compatible with fighters flown by other North Atlantic Treaty Organization partners. Confirmation of the plan comes days after companies in France, Germany and Spain secured the next phase of a rival initiative to build a next-generation fighter that could be in operation from 2040. The United States, which has pledged to defend all three countries through its membership of NATO and a separate security pact with Japan, also welcomed the joint Europe-Japan agreement. The United States supports Japan's security and defense cooperation with like-minded allies and partners, including with the United Kingdom and Italy, the U.S. Department of Defense said in a joint statement with Japan's Ministry of Defense. Japan had initially considered building its next fighter with help from U.S. defense contractor Lockheed Martin Corp., 
which had proposed an aircraft that combined the F-22 airframe with the flight systems from the F-35 fighter.